Hello and welcome back my friend Sourdough Educational Series video number 5 Garden Escaping Design Ask for advice on baking What is the element to get results like bakeries? Let's see the science of baking In order for the bread to have a great oven spring The skin needs to be moist And how we get the moist skin is through steam how to get steam in your home oven there is many way many methods that you can i can try them all but the best result i got when i bought the sourdough brisbane pan believe me if you want to bring your bread to the next level the pot makes the difference obviously you will need to nail the fermentation the stretch and fold and all the rest but that pot makes the difference why we need steam so when you put the bread in the oven uh, imagine the skin if there is nothing to create steam uh, the heat from the oven will crust the skin straight away the bacteria inside are still alive they're pushing co2 and they encounter a tough skin because the heat will just crust in the skin okay so they can't expand uh, the bread so if you're using a pot that trapped all the steam that comes from the bread like for example this is a cast iron dutch oven here is the bread what happened the bread is made by 75 80 percent hydration based on your recipe when you put it in the oven the water from the bread will start to evaporate evaporate creating steam inside the cast iron pot i am explaining also with the sign of the hands <laughs> So, it, so the steam that comes from the bread, from the water evaporated, will create a saturated environment of steam and moist. The moisture will make the skin soft, the bacteria inside are still alive, they're pushing CO2. When they reach 21, 24, 27, 30 degrees, 35 degrees, they expand the bread because the skin is soft, thanks to the steam. And that's how you get the oven spring. Then what happens after usually 20-25 minutes you take the lid off, you, the steam will vent and then the bacteria are dead at the time because the bacteria survive until 60 degrees, certain bacteria like lactobacilli bacteria they will uh, die at 40 degrees. So at 60 they all dead, like I usually say they sacrifice their life for us, that's funny but that's what it is and they make beautiful bread for us. They push the CO2, they expand the bread. If you want the crust to be thicker, what you will need to do once it's fully baked, you turn on the oven, you leave another five, 10 minutes, and the crust will be even thicker. So that's the science of baking. If you don't have a cast iron Dutch oven, you can find many of them from $50 to $300. Like everything, the more you pay, the better you get. If you have a home oven with steam, just make sure the steam saturates the environment. Hope this video reveal a lot of science and why of uh, sourdough baking. I wish when I started to have someone that telling me all of these kind of things because I learned from uh, my mistake. I'm really glad that you can get all this information. Keep baking, uh, love sourdough and spread the knowledge, okay? Thank you so much everyone for sending your questions and I'll see you on the next video. Ciao belli!